We're tackling claims you can make your own hand sanitizer at home. But first, I've got to say, the CDC, WHO, and most other experts say that you should be washing your hands as much as possible and only using sanitizer when you can't. Hand sanitizer should also not be used if your hands are visibly dirty. Okay. We got that out of the way. Here's our core claim. Headlines and articles teaching you how to make your own hand sanitizer if you can't buy any at the store. So can you actually do this? And is it safe and effective? We're verifying. Our sources, the CDC and WHO. When we dug into this, we found recipes from the World Health Organization that have been online for 10 years. They combine alcohol and hydrogen peroxide with a bonding gel. They recommend glycerol, but aloe vera also works. The key to all of this is the alcohol content. Per the CDC, if the alcohol content is 60% or higher, it can kill most bacteria and break down most viruses. Note here, some outlets are saying strong liquor like vodka can be used. Vodka technically is ethanol, which is in the WHO recipes, but most vodka is only about 40% alcohol, which would not meet the CDC and WHO recommendations. Once you've got your ingredients, combine them in a large jar or container, and you have a functioning hand sanitizer. So claim verified. You can make your own effective hand sanitizer. Keep in mind, the recipe is only effective if mixed properly. To help you out, we have the WHO recipe online. And if you're seeing more claims like this, send us an email. With your verify, I'm Jason Puckett.